tonight, we're learning more about a woman who was shot and killed on Friday in Waltham. NBC 5's Sid Bule spent the day talking to state police and a legal expert about this case. Sid, you have some new information for us tonight. That's right, Brian Alice, Vermont State Police are saying that the minor who shot Michelle Kilbreth in Waltham is related to the other woman who was involved in the fight. Now they say right now no charges have been filed yet and they may never be. What's the proof? Can they prove that this child was responsible for this homicide? That's the question facing investigators and the Addison County State's Attorney's Office following a fatal shooting in Waltham, Vermont last Friday by a juvenile in the town. Investigators say 48 year old Michelle Kilbreth was shot and killed during an altercation with another woman in her neighborhood. They didn't like each other, um, did not have the same viewpoints and did not get along. Kilbreth brought a firearm to the property and lost control of it during a physical fight. Then a minor picked up the gun and fatally shot Kilbreth multiple times. We're not gonna identify the juvenile involved due to his age. Police say they also can't share the age of the minor, but he is related to the woman who was fighting with Kilbreth. At this point, investigators are working to determine if the shooting death was justified, as they couldn't confirm whether or not the minor was acting in self-defense. We don't really want to call it anything quite at this rate until we're you know, pretty comfortable that we've got all the information we have and that the state's attorney is able to also make a ruling on this as well. If charges are filed, the next step will be determining which court to try the minor in. It can be in the adult court uh, as for someone as young as 10 years old in a homicide case and a string of other types of offenses. However, police and legal experts say there's a chance that no charges will ever be brought forward. At the end of the day, if there's no one charged, there's no one charged. I mean, it, it is if there is a viable defense. If the state's attorney really is convinced that there is a defense to this by virtue of protecting someone else, then in that case, the case is never going to be brought. But either way, former U.S. Attorney O'Neill says the minor will need support going forward. That child, no matter what, needs counseling, as would an adult in that circumstance. Now, NBC5 also reached out to the Addison County State's Attorney for comment, but she declined given the ongoing investigation. And if you know anything about this incident or have video of it, state police are asking you to please give them a call. Live in Williston, Sid Buley, NBC5 News.